what we could from the red. Comms are up. Lift platform to the shipyard is a hundred clicks north-northeast. We're in the middle of nowhere out here. SDF scout ship came through. We shot it down. There'll be others. We'll be ready for them. Stratcom? No signal. We're isolated. I'll do whatever it takes to keep us secure. You're our leader, sir. Not our savior. I hold myself accountable, Chief. As he should. You aborted the mission, Captain. He saved his ship and crew, Chief. And that's noble, but the shipyard remains intact. Look, the strength of the pack is in all the walls, Captain. All in, no matter the cost. They were ready. Now, if you don't have the will to make that kind of choice, then, like me, you have no place being in command. I couldn't ram my own ship. I would have killed them. They came to win. This... Doesn't look like victory. SDF scout ship! Take cover, watch your round count! That dude's close! All stations, this is Metal One. Ethan, what's your position? Inbound, sir. Mark it now. Check your fire! Robot Army, reporting for duty, sir. He hacked the 
them spots. Full company, sir. I mean, they're idiots, but they can fight. Good work, Metal One. Touchdown and get ready to go. Nice, sir. Captain, we're all with you, sir. Thanks, Chief. Let's get back to work. Nice, sir. We stay trenched in down here. We're sitting ducks. We're not staying here. We're engaging up there. Storm the gates. Fight our way to the top, get ourselves a ship. Password. Raj, I'll get a transport set. Griff's out there, go see him. You need a weapon. Salt. I'm glad you're still here. Hell or high water? Griff. Whatever's gonna kill most of them, and leave a few for me. <laughs> Not everything made it out unscathed. Got your kid on the table over here, sir. Sergeant Brooks, we're moving out. Get your mechs onto the transports. They're spearheading the assault. so that those we fight for do not lose. There are billions of people back home who don't know what, we're, what we've done. Good luck out there. <laughs> Our primary objective is infiltrating the orbital platform. Flying directly up to the shipyard is a no-go due to their active intercept system, so this is a ground assault. Ethan's bots will create a diversion while our ravens insert on the edge of the platform's perimeter. There are three any air guns that need to be taken out before our birds can move in and provide support. I'll prime the ordnance I commandeered from the Olympus Mons to hit those AA turrets. Captain, I'll give you access to a drone to designate those strike positions. Hey, should be a blast. <laughs> Affirmative, Ethan. After the guns are down, we push into the facility shipyard. Dock in five seconds. Copy, Boggs. It's go time! Roger, be advised. LG is hot. Raider flight to Bravo 1. Follow for infill from the west. All elements, stand by for insert! Touchdown! Guns up! Echo 1, go, we are encountering heavy resistance. Watch our enemy drop on. Cover the friendly down! Stay low, get the cover! Copy! Let's target that AA! Copy! 
Hounds are engaging jackals. AA fire stitching us up.
is secure. Move up. Raven 3, inserting Marines.
Ethan, if we don't make it, you head up there and kick all the ass you can find. Ethan can fly that ship. Solid copy, Commander. Plan is to rally at the top. Get her done, sir. Hold it here, Ethan. Roger. Hang on. Eyes open.
deploying every bot they have. Means our forces are putting up a fight down there. Let's see if we can help them out and disable these launchers. Salt, you got one of those charges? Here you go. Doors opening. Let me go before it blows. Let go. She did that so we keep going. The others are still counting on us. You're right. Let's go stop that ambush. We're clear through here. We're clear through here. Enemies up ahead. Stay low. We think Shadow is targeting this level. You too, mark up here. Shuttle guards, get in here. Deploy C6S. We have any colonel targets. That's a shuttle station. Doesn't matter. They're not got to drop on them. The on your go, Reyes. up here and get to that ship. Raj. Ready to load off, Captain. Thanks, sir. Where's the chief? She didn't make it. We gotta go. Clear. All clear. Which ship is it, Ethan? Right there. That's a destroyer. It's got a full payload. Can we use it? To fight our way out? No. To level this place. The ship on fire, Captain. The weapon system is not enabled. Forget the weapons. Let's release the moorings, key in a drop, and go. Boats, how can we enable the payload? Firing control, sir. Where's firing control? Command center, ma'am. It's a shuttle ride, that way. Who's gonna do that? Me. You'll never make it back to the ship. If we wait, they'll fire on us. You're not gonna wait. Captain. How will you get home? No one's going home. You board that ship and you terminate this place all. Do as much damage as you can before SDF takes you out. I can do both. I can hit the shipyard and drop out of here. You won't have time. Watch me. You got the green light to do whatever it takes. Just finish the mission. Everybody good with this? You'll need a crew to launch. We'll have to fight our way out. Shuttle. Brooks, take him out. Ethan, with me. No, ma'am. Captain's gonna need my help to get to the command center. Damn you both. Did you know we were gonna finish this here? No. I think Mac did. Well, I guess I'll see you both in hell. Count on it. Okay, gentlemen, let's move out! Fair winds.
Captain, you copy? Affirmative, Ethan. I'm into them, Edward. About enemy positions. Got eyes on those two, sir. This is suicide, Reyes. I gave my order, Salt. The captain doesn't always bring his men home. Not always. This is your staff, sir. Looks to be clear. Check. Junction room. Should be full of stock you can swipe. Last haul, huh? Regrettably, sir. All set. All set. Where to? All the way to the floor. Guns close. Copy. Airships are moving to your sector. Copy on. Out. Captain, you got a company on the exit. Copy that. I'm enjoying myself, sir. Me too. I'm clear here, Ethan. You'll need to take the elevator to firing control. Almost there. Copy. 
Quite an arsenal. Lieutenant, enemy's boarding! Hey, we're taking casualties here! Ethan, hostile forces are aboard the Lieutenant's destroyer. Sir, firing control entry is dead ahead. Be advised, room is occupied with armed personnel. Roger that. Melt the relays on the ship lock. Ethan, why do you need me for this? Core's electro processor. I'll need your help to stay mobile. Get me, in, get me inside the distribution tax you can sustain. Stay. Concentrate fire! Concentrate fire! <sighs> 
Those officers, aware of the imminent danger, in spite of extensive casualties planned and skillfully executed, an attack with unwavering devotion to their duty. Commander Reyes and Lieutenant Salter gallantly offered their own lives and mobilizing their close range against superior close range against superior firepower. The operation eliminated vital numbers of enemy vessels and destroyed the settlement defense France orbital shipyard. The officer's commitment exhibited the highest traditions of naval service. Peace to the fallen. My dear, my daughter, my daughter, if you are reading this, I guess I didn't make it home. I was prepared to face danger and death. I hope I did so with My time was cut short, but I had countless blessings. I married the perfect woman. I have a brand new daughter on the way. I'd be selfish to ask for more. I love you, Olivia. Welcome and cherish you. Cherish you. Remind her of me. Never be afraid to do what you need to find happiness. Esreen, hello, sweetheart. I left for this tour before you were born. I'm sorry I won't be able to see you grow up. Daddy wanted to make the world. That's why we made you. Try to do one good deed every day. Be safe, my family. Victor.
Marta, the Navy has made my life a long distance love affair. The things I love are all far away, my home, my you. I am, I am doing important work. I'm ready for anything, even this. The military, I know this isn't easy. Please don't cry. I know this isn't easy. Please don't cry for me or us. Cry for a world that couldn't make peace. Of you and my heart races. I smile, I laugh out loud, and people tell me I always seem so happy. I am. I have yours for Yetide. For Yetide. To my dearest wife, Sarah, my son, Noah, and my daughter, Abby. If you're reading this, I can tell you with the utmost confidence that I'd die for something right and just. The cost of war is higher than any one life. And I happily give mine in defense of my men and family. Abby, I'm sorry I didn't keep my promise when I said I was coming home. My hopes for your future gave me the strength to protect everything we hold dear. You will always be Daddy's little girl. Noah, be an honest man. Violence is a last resort. You're the mess of the last resort. You're the man of the house now, Sarah. Please keep us safe. And find it in your heart to forgive me for leaving you alone. If my last breath is not in the battlefield, Keep me in your hearts. Keep me in your hearts. Always. Hey, Mom. Dad. When I joined the Marines, I told you that I'm ready to give my life for fighting for a good cause. Then that's what happened. I hope I died doing... Then that's what happened. I hope I died doing something... And in the long run, and in the long run, I hope that I made you proud. I promised myself I wouldn't get close to people here, but it's kind of impossible not to. I wasn't scared here, but I was homesick. Mom, I had a dream last night that you were making dinner. Yes, my favorite pork chops. <laughs> and we were all at the table to tell Aunt Joyce I said hi and I love her and give Bailey a big kiss and a new tennis ball from me. Everyone here has a mother and father, but you and dad only have one son. So I'm sorry I didn't make it back. Simplify, your loving son, Todd. Dear Andrew, it's fleet week. More ships are dry docked against the dawn sky. I'm home, but it's not home without you. I know I had what every woman envied, a husband that gave life more meaning. You were my handsome better half. Since the day we locked eyes, I thought of you constantly. I still do. The internal drive that earned me my rank cost me a marriage. The Navy imbued me to accomplish the mission, and to that end, I'll never set end. I'll never stop love. Or when I go. I go. Thank you. There was a gift. With love always. Laura. Sir? I'm not quite sure how a son greets us for a lifetime. I guess I'll say. Finally tracked down your address through the Human Resource Department in Washington. I had to use my birth certificate to prove we were related. I want you to know I followed in your footsteps. I joined the Navy, thought it would make you proud. If we ever saw each other, we'd have more to talk about. I went to sniper school to be a sharpshooter, but my vision changed. I became an instructor. I'm currently deployed aboard the UNSA Carrier Retribution. My mom Sandy passed away this year. I went back to the old house just before shipping out and found that my mom kept it all this time. I wish I'd known you spent all this time. I wish I'd known you still lived in Tennessee. I would have dropped by. 
could have had a beer and caught up. I forgive you for leaving. I hope you're not mad at me for writing. You for leaving. I hope you're not mad at me for writing. Thanks for helping bring me into this world. I did my best to be a good man. Maynard Griffin. My dearest. Well, as is least in the event of my death, it may seem somewhat sorrowful, but I don't. I have always felt. I have always felt that our stay on Earth, a gift to be spent in than our to be spent in than ourselves. Death comes to us all. It is not to be feared. I loved my job, but I hated war. But the secret mission I every single day was to protect the two of you from anyone or anything that threatened your health and well-being. So promise me, you will take care of one another and please live your lives to the fullest. With all the love in my heart, Mum. Er. Er. We're behind enemy lines now in the heat of battle. Time is short. You've given an order from which there is likely no return. You did what had to be done. All in. I'm proud of you. You're a born leader, sir. Today was one of the worst days in history. And uh, forgive me for saying it, but it was the greatest day of my life. I did everything I was trained for and more. Together, we fought. You said we were brothers. You said we were brothers. I always wanted to know what a family really is. Now I do. Admiral Raines told me that a soldier is only as good as his last mission. If this is ours, then I can say with certainty, we were damn good, sir. Better to burn out than it is to rust. <laughs>